We're so glad you're here for this opportunity to meet Dr. Wilton and to enjoy his book. And thank you also for your investment and your prayers and your encouragement here in the library. We're delighted you're here today. Let's then welcome Dr. Don Wilton to say a couple words to us. Well, hello everyone. Hello. Goodness, how, how marvelous to see you today in such a, a beautiful place as this. Um, I have uh, so many wonderful memories and thoughts and, uh, of, of Mr. Graham and this beautiful Billy Graham library and uh, culminating when he went home to be with the Lord. And, uh, you know, I will never for the rest of my life ever forget uh, being just right over there. And I think there's a picture and I've got a picture of it in Saturdays with Billy. And before the President of the United States, and the Vice President came in to greet the family, um, I walked over to Mr. Graham's casket and I just stood there and said, Hello, Billy. How are you, my dear brother? And we just had a little chat together. And as I stood there at the foot of that casket, all of a sudden, the sun began to shine through that cross. And you can see it in the picture. And that sun came right over the top of me and seemed to stretch out the very touch of God from the heavens. And you know, as I stood there on that day, and as millions of people around the world began to ponder the life and testimony of someone as precious as Dr. Billy Graham. All I could do was say, thank you, Jesus. And so Saturdays with Billy, it's not a biography. We've got wonderful biographies. This library tells an incredible story about coming and going and connecting and being and people and places no as David Bruce will tell you a man who himself just ministered to Mr. Graham for so many years my story is just about something that I don't know that I'll ever be able to fully understand myself <laughs> sitting at the feet of one of God's peerless servants for nearly 25 years when I sat down eventually to write this, I just found my heart just flowed. And it all pointed to Jesus. And there's so much more that can be said. But there's so much more to be done. And before I sit down and sign a book today for you, I just want to tell you what Mr. Graham told me because one of the things I did was turn to him not once but on a number of times and said to Mr. Graham, who's next? What are we going to do? Please don't leave us. Don't go anywhere. We, we don't know how. I don't know what I'm going to do without you. Who's going to be the next great man of God? And, and he looked at me. He looked at me. You're looking at me. And he said, why you are Don? And I just for a moment, I thought to myself, my, Mr. Graham thinks that much of me. And then he very quickly said, and so is everyone who knows and loves Jesus. Do you know who that is? That's you and you and you and you and me and you and me. God loves you. And when you read this book, I pray as you read it and pass it on and are touched in only a way that God can, gaining a glimpse into the heart of this precious man. Just remember one thing. You read, God's using you. 
And I'm telling you, it's amazing how God will use each one of us to lead so many people to Christ. Thank you for being such a blessing. And thank you for giving me an indescribable honor being here at the library like this the audacity of me signing a book please don't look at my signature it's only about mr graham and i'm going to tell you something if you for one minute think it's about mr graham you're wrong because he only wanted us to think about jesus let's do this